Okay, welcome to um, the newest issue. This is um, concerning the cancer dog. And as you will see on the captions um, before, those are the dates. If there are any dates um, uh, 12 years previous than the first one put up, just notify me and I will tell you what the, um, uh, the dates you have to be to uh, fall into this category, this lovely sign. Okay, with the cancer dog, well, we have a, a, a ultra sensitive child, uh, but we also have a, a very righteous child in the sense of fairness. Fairness will be key, and um, the, this will make um, this sign very popular amongst children who um, may not be the top kids in the class or the or the big kids that uh, run about the playground. You know. Um, they're not a bully, but what they will do, they will fight the corner for the ones that are being bullied or the ones that aren't being treated so well because of their uh, sense of justice is so high, um, and they very, you know, they really are so sensitive to how other people are feeling. Um, this makes them an ex excellent um, uh, sports captain and also an excellent uh, spokesman uh, or spokesperson for. Um, their years and they normally do very well here uh, where they will bring any student bodies um, they will be the, the voice and they will seek um, fairness and change a lot of changes in uh, schools or colleges universities have been um, uh, masterminded by uh, a cancerian dog where you know they've got the rights um, for all the students and they've, and they've made things happen um, and that's Basically, down to how sensitive they are, and they will, and they will talk for the ones who are quieter, and they will um, be that shoulder to cry on, or that person to talk to, um, especially in situations like that. So, if we uh, move on, um, this is not going to be a sign that is um, running about with other uh, the opposite sex um, or possibly the same sex, whatever way they whatever way they roll, but um, they're not going to be runners around, they're going to be far too um, far too involved in uh, so many different hobbies and different aspects of life that that part of them does get neglected, um, as I say they're not a promiscuous sign whatsoever, in fact completely the opposite, um, but they do tend to let their uh, heartstrings not get tugged on because of basically because of their sensitivity they have a fear that they're going to fall apart if they do fall in love and the other aspects of their life um, will will take a downturn so that's they're very wary of that so they don't let that happen especially when they're young um, if they are going to get involved which they, they tend to do and it's going to be late 20s early 30s and when they do get involved um, their family, their surrounding family is still going to be majorly important to them. That is their life, um, great grand grandparents, great uncles, um, aunties, everything about them. They will be ha spe needing uh, to spend a lot of time with them. So you will have to share this sign. You will have to share them greatly. Um, but what you will get with this sign, you will get um, a lot of tenderness. You will get um, a deep love. And sometimes you might fi may find them a bit clingy. Um, this, this happens sometimes when worries come along. Um, they can be a little bit on the clingy side. They can also um, be a touch oversensitive to um, their loved ones. So you may say something innocuous or not meaning particularly any harm whatsoever, and they can be deeply hurt. And that's um, this thing where they try and shroud it, they try and hide it to try not to let that happen but sometimes it's unavoidable um, in the workplace they can be hurt as well even though they will fight the corner for everyone they will take the hurt and they will but they bear it inside um, and it will manifest there and that's where they do have their health problems later on um, a great profession for, for this uh, unique combination would be um, a lawyer or a solicitor um, Founding a new group would be totally up their street, but um, getting justice, um, whether the prosecution uh, lawyer or, or defending one, either way, and they would only take a case if they genuinely believed 
what they were being told was true. Um, they are truth seekers. Um, I wouldn't advise lies, lying to these because that's when they would be majorly hurt, um, more so than any other sign. Uh, I wouldn't lie to them, um, but if you want somebody to take your case where you are innocent, but you feel as though the odds are against you, um, this seek out a dog cancer lawyer would be fantastic, absolutely brilliant, and would fight your corner, and uh, 99 times out of 100, they will win it for you. So um, that's a, a key point for them. Also, they would make um, a fantastic doctor, um, and um, you know, just things like that where they need the balance is needed, they have the balance but in their personal life they haven't the balance so they don't normally allow this to happen. So let's imagine um, they've met somebody late late 20s, early 30s, they've met somebody and it's going well um, and there's going to be children on the horizon. They're going to be fantastic parents, very protective, um, very nurturing, um, may, maybe a little on the strict side but it's only because they want the absolute best and um, they will provide the absolute best. Um, nothing is too much. Um, there will be bouts of strictness, but um, you know sometimes um, children uh, to these uh, to this uh, parent or uh, parents, if uh, they're both similar, um, they will respond greatly because they know it's for their own good. There's nothing ever uh, ever spiteful about the dog uh, cancer. Um, they can be a little dreamy when they're allowed to. Um, let their minds flow and they can be very creative but as I say they tend to stick to solidity and they tend to stick to traditions uh, the right the right ways to bring up children um, so education will be made really important to them for their child and also um, good manners and uh, very good behaviour and um, many a child will quake, quake in its boots if it has to bring home a bad report to these parents because they will really really take this as an affront. So, um, but the children will know this by now and they know they'll be provided, there'll be some wonderful family holidays, um, you know, you'll always be kitted out, uh, no one, they will never go without because the dog cancer will give up what it has rather than their children go without, so there's never going to be a problem there. So if we look at the um, the best matches for this, um, this lovely sign, um, as with the dogs I always like to see them with the tigers, and the horses, um, this this combination is no exception. So I would seek out um, a Scorpio tiger, um, a Pisces tiger, and also a Taurian tiger would be fantastic. And and, and also um, the Virgo tiger. Try that. Um, they would be wonderful matches, and they would allow you um, to that can you side of your nature in personal, and they will allow it, and they won't. Um, be smothered by it, they will quite enjoy that. Another sign that will enjoy that will be the horse that will love the dedication as well. Even though the horse is a little unpredictable, um, it will love that um, that tenderness. And uh, so I would uh, stick with the same Western signs for that. So that's the Scorpion, the Piscean, the Taurian, and the Virgo. And you can also try with the dog, uh, also try the rabbits. And the rabbit, um, Pisces, uh, also a rabbit cancer and a rabbit scorpio, they would be a very um, nice and gentle match as well and uh, very productive um, financially as well with the rabbit and the dog. Um, the negative, well the negative is always going to be the dragon with the dog um, and that goes right across the board any of the western uh, allies of the dragon. Um, it's just far too flamboyant and uh, too all-consuming, the dog won't um, want to go there. Remembering um, the dog in a love-making situation is a very tender animal and a very tender being. And uh, love-making to a cancer dog can be um, so gentle and soft, whereas the dragon needs a lot more um, demonstrating of the, of, of the uh, a lot more power and a lot more uh, physical. Um, happenings that, as opposed to what is going to happen. So um, they would look elsewhere then the dragon, feeling that they aren't um, being nourished. So there's um, a lookout for you. Um, try and avoid each other if possible. But um, but as I say, what a, a fantastic sign and a solid traditional sign. Um, 
it's a fantastic net for those I've, I've said uh, before. But hey, you could try to on with any of them. As I say, this is a very um, adaptable, but um, maybe not as hot-blooded as some would like. Okay, thank you very much, and uh, tune in for the next episode.